move around. You gotta gotta try and keep this little army moving, and that's why Innovation may be able to get rid of a fifth base and keep rid of a fifth base. Nah, just sets up though. Oh my god. Um, how do you fight this? Do you fight this? Ooh. What? What? Oh my god. Literally Anidas and all the lurkers in the main. I'm gonna put it on my other screen now. And... Uh... uh hold on. Sorry. I can't really do the camera with this screen, so I'm gonna do myself smaller. I'm gonna hit the button. Oh shit, hold on. I'm coming back, chat. It's still, Okay, you see it? It's still there? <laughs> Jesus. I gotta hit the button. I gotta hit a button! It's switched! Fucking ruined! <laughs> I gotta hit a button, dude! It's across the deck! It didn't even... It didn't even drink... Baby. Here's me day off. I'll be finished today soon. I like to have a normal human life. Um, it allows me to vaguely resemble a human rather than... You see one, some Twitch streamers, they steadily just become... Okay, poke, poke champ! Poke champ! You know? Like, you get that. And they're not like a, they're not like a person anymore. They just spout, like, random emotes, but they verbalize them. So yeah. So I try I try to I try to spend time And I think we might be beginning to have a winner. I mean we do have a trap doing damage across the map. The army supplies are still so close. Stas is gonna chase for anything and everything he can in this main base. Disruptor goes down again, not just one but two disruptors going down to that. Oh no, another shot from Stats and that will do it! That's gonna be the GG and we do get ourselves tied up one to one between the two players here. How about that for some PvP action, guys? Some awesome games here so far. I'll tell you what, we're going to run a quick two minutes of ads. We'll be right back. He doesn't have to fight here if he doesn't want to. It looks like he wants to. He's already losing a lot of those circlings. They are taking a lot of damage. And with that War Prism here and the Immortals, I don't think the, um, I don't think the Ravagers alone are going to be enough. He's going to need more forces. Oh, no. Well, all right. No, never mind. <laughs> all right. It was enough. It was enough. <laughs> I guess also, right, when you fight at the other side. Using time's choke point against them. Now enters that third base. The fourth base is floating back to the natural. Both things get taken out with nothing to protect them. Both liberators get taken out. And the Vikings landing would be great against tanks or not great against Marines. And Beyond is going to take us to a game three. Woo wee. Things are getting so dramatic. People are like, calm down, zombie grub. Told you, Bion's fine. Bion. It's only 34 drones as well, compared to Specialist 47, plus a couple of mules. Okay, we'll see what Neural Parasites can do. Neural Parasites gonna do a lot, though, actually. I don't think Special was expecting this many infestors. I don't think pushing out was the right call. If he had just played defensive and scanned and... Predi well, who, yeah. predicts who predicts this? Who predicts this many neural parasites? What is this? Wings of Liberty? Yeah, I mean, he just had so much gas in the bank. The special's probably like, oh, you're not really mining, right? And yeah, he wasn't, but he had so much gas. Spent it on the Ephesus, which are gas heavy, and now he loses almost everything to mm -hmm. neural parasite. It just turns, you know, what's a slight army supply lead for a laser into something which can just dominate. And he really drove the zealots out, and there is still quite some firepower in the remaining units off TY, but. I like that. I feel like he did not overextend. He's like, you know what? I'm going to go back. TY drops the scan at the third base of Max Pax. He's like, oh, Robo, Robo Bay. That's not good. I hope that's your only Robo. We know that's not the case. I don't really like that Max Pax is building a war prison right now. I feel if you've done this much damage, Wadi, you should just get some battle units out. You don't need to worry about getting more aggression done on the other side of the map. Just get those Colossus, get those Immortals, survive and be way 
how the boys held up while we were gone. Come back, everyone's just dead. Kerrigan's just standing there laughing. Like, ha, huh, Jim, I knew you would go down there. Let's go! Let's go! Liberty completionist brutal. Let's fucking go, boys. Let's fucking go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. He's keep pushing forward. He is killing Banelings before the fungal units get caught. Oh, but the Blind Clouds force him to run into some Banelings. Back and forth here, Zombie Grub on the start of this fight. <laughs> it is. The Blind Cloud even affecting the Ravagers for a second there. Cross is coming down, hitting some of the Medivacs. Reinforcements from Ethermal, a little over eager, are going to be cleaned up by the Lings. And Ethermal overestimated his fighting chance right there. I think he saw, you know, mostly Roach Ravager left and was like, okay, maybe I can do this. But the Banelings, I mean, while they didn't get great connections, it is like they supported the idea of having to split, having to run away, letting Dark's army actually do its Survival damage. Instincts. And I cooked this guy. Oh, I didn't transfer mage food. Wild shot. Just keep at him. I'll um I'll storm bolt him if he gets really close. Yep, he's dead here. <laughs> oh, oh, never mind. Oh, what does he want, son of a bitch? Je dis j'ai la chef si j'ai envie quoi. Si j'oublie c'est qu'est-ce qu'on s'en branle là, au final. Putain l'enculé de sa mère quoi. Qu'est-ce qui me pète les bûts en l'enculé quoi. Je vais tous les mute ces fils de pute. Une fois qu'ils sont tous mute ça sera terminé. Je me ferai plus chier. Je pourrais me focus sur mon gameplay. Putain j'ai un inconfort infini les gars. Je me sens mais. Genre dès qu'il y a un dès qu'il y a un Reaper, je je sais pas, je sens que tu sais j'ai envie de tout casser, de balancer des droites partout quoi. C'est euh, c'est un truc de ouf. <rire> against these openers, against having to build an access over there. I don't think it's ever truly comfortable, right? There's experience and inexperience, but then as far as comfort, maybe that's the wrong word. Helen's already getting a decent bit of damage. John six wow. probes go down, eights probably will before he's done with this portion of the attack. And then there is more on the way, but he's not getting into the main base to see a dark shrine. Yes, it's it's really good damage. It's just you don't get any scouting, and the scout. Unacceptable command. No, oh, he somehow dodged my uh, Widow Mines. <laughs> boo, boo, boo. We won that game, guys. We won. Feels good, feels good. Do, 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 do. All right, gets rid of the one on the high ground there. That was the MVP siege tank for the time being. Here we go. Once again, a committal to the cleanup. Will it be enough? It looks like it may not be. The Liberators are very strong here. Together with the Marauders pushing through. The Lurkers don't stand a chance anymore. GG is called Cure. Getting game number five into his pocket. Queen comes out. I'm surprised that he fought this with drones, but I mean, not the wrong decision because he's kind of won that fight. And now the spines are going down. And Evo to attempt to block and save the spines a little bit longer. But Reno has the surround on the spines. Bly has the queens to try and get rid of somehow. And he's going to come up with the surround on the queen, but then he moves it. Spinecrawler is here, Reynor is going to get rid of one, he'll get rid of the other. Bly types out GG, and Reynor is going to take it 3-0, to zero, knocking out Bly from TSL. Here. Zerglings joining in as well as the stocks just blinked underneath the Mutalisk. It looks like Ragnarok is going to go for the base trade, and Trap is going to follow suit. Coming in on the other side, the Zerglings trying to ram themselves into the natural base. The Stalkers 
Oh, not gonna be enough here. GG is called. Ragnarok getting himself. Game number five. Three to two. He did it. He actually managed. My man. My man, Ragnarok. What a guy. GG. Alright. For the people, is that there should be government assistance with detection in each base. Each nexus, in my personal opinion, and it is the opinion shared by many Americans, is that bases should have one cannon by default for widow mine situations such as this. If you look here, the Terran has killed 46 workers with only four units. And it's time in 2020 that this needs to come to an end. We need to agree that Protoss deserves at least one cannon, if not two, at each nexus so that their probes can work safely. Okay, that's my... That's <laughs> Sag euch, das wird ein Drone Pull. Promise. Caster Ehrenwort. Obwohl da noch keine Dings unterwegs ist. Noch keine Drohne, um Spine zu. Ja, boom! Was habe ich euch gesagt? Calls, Freunde, Calls. Calls. Dead tank, and that is a very scary scenario for Bjorn, who's master paying a bunker just to buy some time. Looks like his Liberator was at least pushed away. I mean, it grabbed that 6 SUV, it's actually really not bad, but can he hold back on the... Yeah, because now you're gonna lose the bunker, then you get a little bit better act entry. Ooh, okay, and these Marines are gonna come back in the main, I like that. Because that's really the sort of way you can deal some good damage here. There's really. a shield battery finishing up. Force fields will go down. Guardian shield being popped forward. Link Showtime wants to get the prism. Doesn't get it. Okay, Ooh. but he still gets a pretty good stalker fight. Yeah, he's going to blink forward. Now he gets the prism. That's what he wanted to go for here because he wants to shut down the potential reinforcements. Showtime pushes me back. And he's chasing as well, Roddy. And he's getting extra stalkers as he goes. Showtime absolutely dominating this engagement. And Neve. Well, not really finding much. He's trying to blink on this high ground, but again, Showtime blinking forward aggressively. He really believe we can keep on chasing and killing stalkers, and he ain't wrong. Nope, he ain't wrong. GG, Mr. Mauer picks up the first game here.